Hey everyone, Ken Surfs here. We're in the shave den and it's time for another shave. I've been reading some of the comments and somebody had mentioned you don't do a lot of shaves with Parker razors. And you know, uh, you're true. It's true. I have the Parker variant and it's pretty much an all-in-one razor. It, uh, you know, it's adjustable so I can get an aggressive shave, a mild shave. I really like the variant, but people said, hey, what about the basic or one of the basic razors? How about the Parker 97R? Can you give it a try? And I said, sure. So I went on Amazon, I picked this up and we're gonna see here. Do we have any double-edged safety razor, blah, blah, blah. Parker since 1973. All right, you can get this basic packaging here. And you get a nice, weighty Parker 97 razor. Now, that looks like it's about the same size handle as the uh, the uh, 34C, the Mercure 34C that I use. And it's a three-piece. Threading seems nice. Yep, threading locks up really nice. It's a three-piece basic, same head as you see on most of these razors. Don't know how aggressive it's going to be, but we are going to be using this today. I'm going to be using a uh, Porosso Green. Uh, it's kind of my go-to when I'm trying out a new razor. And they did give me a pack of Parker Blades, but uh, I'm not familiar with Parker Blades. So if the blade's terrible, it might look like the razor's terrible. You know, I, I don't know how the shave's going to come out. I haven't practiced. This is going to be the first time. You're going to see it for the first time. So I'm not going to use blades that I'm unfamiliar with. I'm going to use some blades that I'm very familiar with. Also from India, this is uh, Gillette Wilkinson Sword. Wilkinson Sword Gillette from India. The Saloon Pack. So I'll be using that. And somebody said, hey, what about an old spice shave? Look, original original Old Spice. Look at this. It's usually up on that shelf behind me. And this bottle is almost full. Original Schulten Old Spice with a gray cap. Still smells good. So I'm going to be using this aftershave today. Oh, and I did pick up, uh, thanks for the tip. Uh, one of you tipped me off uh, that uh, grapefruit is available by Tobbs, still makes it, they still make it. And I got a brand new, brand new uh, grapefruit Tobbs from Amazon. So yes, I was almost completely out of my other. This is very good. I really enjoy that. And last but not least, we'll be using the Chubby, Chubby 2 Synthetic with a ruby red handle. I like that. We'll get that in there. Perfect. All right. Let me clear off some of this and we'll start. All the right. Shape. Got most of it cleared off. Sweat the face a little bit. Hope your week's going good. Almost to the middle of the week now. In fact, you'll probably be seeing this tomorrow. So you'll probably be seeing this on Wednesday. Porosso Green, one of my favorite Porossos. The white's pretty good too, because it's for uh, sensitive skin. But uh, the green I really like. The menthol clears your nose like there's no tomorrow. There we go. Almost time for another Ken Search brush to come out. I'm talking with DS Cosmetics right now, and uh, we're exploring new handles for the uh, holiday season 2024. All right. Let's load up this uh, razor, shall we? Get a nice new blade out here. I get my uh, 
my these saloon packs from eBay. They're very reasonable. They take a little while to get here from India, but they're very reasonably priced, and uh, I really do enjoy them. But I am having a lot of fun using other blades lately. Rex blades, Persona blades, Battle Brothers blades. All right. I get a little bit more overhang on this side than I do on this side. Blade locked in pretty good. Very little gap there. Let's see how she does. Ooh. Feels a little more aggressive than the 34C. I'm going to rotate it. Very smooth though. Yeah, this is more aggressive. I can just tell by the feel. It's, it's getting the uh, whiskers down on one pass very well. No, excellently is a one pass razor. At least this combo is a one pass razor for me, for my skin. You guys familiar with this one? What's your comparison compare? You know, have you used uh, this in comparison with uh, Mercure or uh, Edwin Jagger. Oh man, that I'm, I'm I'm absolutely telling you, there's no reason. In fact, I'm going to be tempting fate here. I'm gonna I'm gonna do a two pass, but there's no reason. This is very very smooth, close shave, and I'm no nicks yet. I'm definitely tempting fate here. Yeah, the variant covered all bases for me. You're not an adjustable Parker. Why would I want several, you know? But this price was very incredible. So I'm getting a close shave with a very reasonably priced razor. Little bit of feedback. I'm gonna be nervous here. No blood on the soap. Perfect. Okay, super close shave, very, very close. The only thing I saw wrong with it, nothing's wrong with it. I just see a little bit more blade overhang on that side than I see on that side, big deal. Very super close shave. All right, since it's a very super close shave, <laughs> I'm a little nervous about this. Vintage Shulton. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. There's a burn. Ooh. Oh, man. 
you know, there is a little bit of a difference in scent between the old vintage and the new stuff. I mean, it's close enough. You could tell if you were smelling it, that's Old Spice, but man, I was very lucky enough to find this, uh, you know, almost full in the box. And I think it was on eBay. Very good. Well, thank you very much for watching. Another shave under the belt. And we have new stuff from PAA on the way here. And I look forward to trying that out in uh, an upcoming video. Thanks very much. Stay safe.